welcome to the Prince Abdullah Al Faisal Sports City Stadium in Jeddah. My name is Rob Welsh. I'll be with you for the semi-finals of the eighth West Asian Football Federation Women's Tournament in this clash between Nepal versus Lebanon, live on this lovely clear evening. There's the blow of the whistle indicating the game is now underway. And Lebanon wasted no time on an early quick fire attack. Lebanon versus Nepal, nil nil. Nepal pushing forward. In goes across. Reflected by defender Cynthia Salah. Nepal are using a lot of playing a lot of lobs at this game. They only play a lot of short passes. Here we have Sabrita again. And Nepal in the attack again. Sabrita. She was looking at the goal just then. Cynthia. A little bit too much behind the ball there, Cynthia. Nepal are back. Sabrita. Anita. Oh. 37 minutes into the first half. We've got our first substitute. Quick ball finding Samira. And it has resulted in the first own goal. The first goal for Lebanon. Scored by Pooja Rana. Uh, unbelievable. Again, I, I think the, the issue here is the Nepalese team are not really communicating. They're not communicating, communicating as well as what they normally do. It's, they're not playing the normal um, confident, competent football that they've been playing in the last three games. Nepal on the attack again. It's one on one with the keeper. Nepal don't seem to be communicating very well today. And Le Lebanon on a, having an early attack there. Right on the corner of the box. Samira. And easily picked up by the Nepal again. Hira Bujo. Pretty right. Crossing in front of the goal. There's nobody there. Oh! What a save there by Lamita. Bumala Chaudhry. Just a little bit. Not enough there behind the ball. She took the shot. Just wasn't enough behind it. Natalie. Blocking the shot. Gita pushing it over to Hira again. Hira looking it for a teammate. Cross it in. Let's see. Over to. Straight to the. Oh! Rashimi. I think it's a little bit too much there. And here we go, it's another attack. Is it? No. It's, <laughs> it's in. I cannot believe it. Sabrita Bandari manages to get the first goal for Nepal. Simple mistake by Amina Kareem. Simple mistake. She's really beating herself up over this one. This is not the kind of game that we've been expecting to see. This is, this is totally opposite to what we were expecting today here at the semi-finals you can see the look Amina Kareem absolutely gutted she turned she she was there she didn't know what she, it, it was almost as if she didn't know which direction to kick the ball and then Sabrita Bandari just came stole it from her one-on-one -on -one with the keeper here keeper stops it Christine chasing the ball she just didn't get there on time over to goalkeeper Angela Gita 
Probably back in the attack again. Sabrita. Oh! Deflected. Sabrita Vandari. Looking for that second goal. Samira. Sabita. Oh! Good save there by Lamita. Could have been quite dangerous there if, if uh, Hira got to the ball there. It's the only corner kick for Nepal. This could be it. Last minute of the second half. Corner kick. In comes the kick. What a goal! Nepal finally! Dipper Shahi! And that comes, that then seals the deal and puts an end to the Lebanon side at the WAFF tournament today. Nepal will be facing Jordan in the finals. Last minute. What a goal there! Great performance. Great goal by Pretty Rai. She just stood back and rocketed it straight to the back of the net. And I think the referee has blown the final whistle there at the Prince Abdullah Al Faisal Sports City Stadium in Jeddah, indicating that's the end of the match today. And Nepal advanced to the finals against Jordan in two days on the 29th make sure you're there to watch this clash between Nepal and Jordan that's certainly going to be one game to be you know it's going to be the final the match final that's definitely one game to not miss uh, the, so the final score is Nepal 2 and Lebanon 1 it's Robert Welsh here with you hope you've enjoyed the match this evening stay tuned for more West Asian Football Federation tournament final which is happening in two more days on the 29th between nepal and jordan thank you good night shukran assalamu alaikum it's been a pleasure